Hello, Ms. Smith. I'd like to thank you for coming down and, and agreeing to answer some questions for us um, regarding the hit and run accident that Could you, you recently on? witnessed. Mm -hmm. Uh, we'd like to ask you a few questions about what you saw, and uh, this is the uh, interpreter, and uh, she'll help us get through uh, these questions. I uh, just explained to, um, to the witness that I'll be uh, listening to you complete your questions at that time, um, interpreting them to Zelly, and I will be watching her rendition and at the completion um, voicing it or saying it in English to you. Oh, I see. Oh, all right. Okay, fine. And she agreed uh, to do that? It's acceptable. Oh, that's fine. Okay. Uh, let me start off with just getting uh, some basic information. Uh, what is your address? Uh, my address is 17B School Street in Landover, Maryland. Okay, and what is the zip code there? Two one two seven five. All right, thank you. And your home phone number? Three zero one six four two seventeen forty two. Is that your uh, home phone number or your work phone number? That's my home phone number. Would you mind giving us your work phone number also, so that if we have any more questions, we can contact you during the day? I'm currently unemployed. All right, fine. So we can contact you with your home number during the day? <coughs> Correct. All right, fine. Now, let me start uh, with a few questions about the, the accident. You say you did actually see the accident occur. Yes, I did in fact witness the accident. I was at the mall shopping. Upon coming out, uh, my friend and I were coming out. Um, we had to move out of the way. I saw the car swerve and hit a parked car. Oh, I see. Uh, do you remember what color the car was?
The car was a mixture of green, blue. It's a greenish blue. It wasn't a pure green or a pure, a pure blue. Mm -hmm. uh, you say you saw the car swerving. How fast would you say the car was moving? Uh, It was moving fast, uh, I'd say uh, between 30 and 40 miles per hour. Mm -hmm. Now, did you see uh, in which direction the car drove off after it hit the parked car? Uh, after hitting the parked car, the car pulled back, backed up, and went out via the front entrance to the mall. At that point, I didn't see which direction the car went in. Okay, did you notice about uh, how many other witnesses there may have been standing around who might have noticed uh, the accident? It was my friend and I that saw the accident. As far as other witnesses being present, I'm not sure. All right. Who did you see in the car? I didn't uh, see who was in the car. I don't know if it was a male or a female. I do know the person had short, dark hair and looked, appeared to be looking through the studio. Mm -hmm. Did you by any chance catch the license plate number or anything about the license plate? The car was going rather fast, um, so I didn't get a clear description. I do know that the license plate background was white with orange lettering. It appeared to be the state of either Florida or Georgia and had the letters um, M and M. The reason that I know that is um, because it made me think of the can the M and M candy. All right. Do you think you recognized what kind of car it was? I'm not sure. It was either a Honda or a Taurus or an Escort. I'm not sure. Did it seem like it was a, a newer model, maybe like a 93, a 92? Would you know, would you be able to recognize that?
The car was a brand new car, um, brand new. So it's really unfortunate the car was damaged. So the car that, uh, that hit and then kept going also had damage to it. Yes, I'm speaking in terms of the car that um, hit and ran. That's the car that had damage to it. All right. Is there anything else you can tell me that you noticed? Anything different, strange, uh, about either the person driving or something about that person or something about the car or anything unusual? What struck me as, un uh, there is something that did strike me as unusual. Um, the way in which the car swerved um, put me in mind of perhaps the driver having had a heart attack or a seizure or inebriated. Um, that was odd. All right. All right. Well, thank you. Thank you very much for coming down and, and answering these questions. And if we have any more questions, then we will call you. We really appreciate you coming down, though. And thank you to the interpreter also. You're welcome. <laughs>